begin in Wuaraka at the NYS headquarters where uh, the CS for Public Service and Gender, uh, Margaret Corby, a professor, is uh, leading um, some efforts there. Of course, this is the handover of COVID-19 donations to women caucus leaders. Let us now listen in. Containment, I think we have also, it has also called for the need to have the, 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 the sanitizers, the soap, the girls' kit, the, the boys' kit, the family kit, food, because of this containment. And the, for the fact that we know the COVID crisis has also generated a lot of job losses, I think that's why we need to come together as the women members of parliament have asked us to do so that we can be able to share or ease out or help in coping with those containment. And uh, for, for women members of parliament to have thought about how they are going to go about this and they reach out to the Ministry of Public Service and Gender, I just want to thank you very much. By the time Honorable Alice Wahome was talking to me, we had no idea where we would get the first bucket or even the first mask. But the fact that she was able to say we would need this, then we went to the minister and said, well, how can we help members of parliament, women, to be able to access some of these uh, facilities that we need? So the message there is a good idea can get better mm. when it is shared and more so thinking solution oriented. Not always to put challenges on the table, also do put solutions. So when he, uh, she mentioned and we thought, how do we and raise that solution, we are here and we are able to give a lot of these, to share this equipment, which will not go just to women. I'm sure when they go to their constituency, both women and men are going to benefit from these uh, resources that are being shared here today. Let me also uh, thank all the organizations that have been able to, to participate or to contribute to one the event of today in terms of uh, National Youth Service who have given 7,500 masks which are here. <laughs> we have also been given by UNFPA about 600 div kits that the members of parliament will be able to take with them. Th these kits involves boys kit, uh, girls dignity kit and a family kit. And they have also been able to say during this time of washing hands we need jerry cans, we also need buckets, and they have given us about 600 of them. We have received very many sanitizers from Kenya Pipeline uh, Corporation, and I think, uh, I think there's also another uh, uh, organization that has given us uh, some sanitizers which we'll be able to take to the constituencies. The Women Enterprise uh, uh, Fund has given us also uh, masks and some sanitizers that we'll be able to take with you. And I'm sure crew here saying they want to partner with us to start cash transfer to the most vulnerable.